I don't care, y'all. Y'all gonna have to help me out. If I'm sounding like a hater, so be it. But check me if I am. I just want to know how the freak does Martel Hulk keep getting all these women publicly claiming him in the TVs, all in the videos, all on the music videos, and smiling and on Real Housewife Atlanta claiming him and pictures and co-ops. I don't get it. I don't understand it. And for the life of me, I need y'all to help me figure it out because... After Martel's reputation, and everybody knows how he gets down, how is he getting women like this? I'm really confused. I'm so glad that what's happening, YouTube channel reporting on this, because it just has me thinking. How come it feels as though that women have to be Pulitzer Prize winning, Nobel Peace Prize grabbing, Grammy Award winning status type women? Mother Teresa, get back to the poor, the needy, uh, backflip Olympian type women to even get a man. But men can be liars and cheaters, deceivers, heartbreakers, and I won't let you back in my life. So I'm taking remember that song. The house, the cars, the kids, and the dogs. I want it all. You nothing but. But either way. Why, like, Martel is able to get these women, and we all know how he get down? It's like, the same don't apply for men. You know what I mean? It's just like, just be male, and you can get a woman. But I feel like the standards are so high for women that men, if your lace front is on crooked, the baby hair don't swoop right, they ready to X you out. But you see how forgiving and how open and accommodating women are, even to men that don't really deserve it. Because I feel as though, as women in general, why not have each other's back? Why do why do we feel as though not all women, but some women feel as though he ain't gonna do that to me, he ain't gonna be like that with me, and we all seen how he did Melody. I'm like very confused by that. And to the fact that Sheree, Housewives of Atlanta, will literally go on and bring Martel and publicly claim Martel as her man or her guy friend or whatever on a national platform such as Real Housewives of Atlanta knowing how he gets down like i just do not get that what is the hype about martel y'all gonna have to help me figure it out you know a lot of people do find him attractive but i don't so let's just take off the attractiveness his personality is kind of boring to me but maybe like it's something about him that we just don't see because i'm actually confused by this like and here go this lady at the hold in or whatever smiling cheesing with martel couldn't be me couldn't be me just for the simple fact that you know it just don't look right i don't know like i wouldn't even want nobody to get the idea that i was cool with martel no i'm just kidding honestly because he he's a human being too so it's not like i don't want to judge him but i just do find it funny that i'm pretty sure it's women that's lined up to still date him in spite of everything that's out there about him you know you don't have to go hard digging through his phone to find it it's like public records it's playing out in front of us on youtube on social media on instagram on the show yet he still get women i'm, I'm really <sighs> perplexed by this so hopefully this lady is not dating him i didn't gather that from the video but it just looks as though they're getting pretty chummy but y'all go ahead and hit over to the what's happening youtube channel to hear her talk about the situation more but all i know is that it triggered me when i seen that he had a, a lady friend after charade now it's okay for coleslaw to be kind of stuck on stupid at the end of the day you know they have a baby together so now they tie for life and now she going to see why the ex-wife was having trouble that's i, I mean i really <sighs> I feel like that mindset of I can make it work should be applied to building yourself up or going after a business venture, not trying to change a man. But for some reason, um, women do that a lot. You know, it won't happen to me, but they'll never bet on themselves in that kind of way. But nevertheless, so cold saw she stuck she had a baby by him she gonna think about the days when she did not have that type of tie to martel she think that she was in the competition with male but she just kind of like put an anchor an anchor around her 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 leg 
And then she stuck with him for life. She wanna think about those days where she could just go and be as free as she wanted to and only hooked up with him on occasion, but she went and had a baby. Even though it takes two to tangle, but she's going to see what Melody was putting up with. And she's probably gonna wish that she would have stayed away. When everything, when the dust settles, and if the show go off, because at the end of the day, she gives me, Arian gives me the vibes that she lives for the moment. Not, she don't really think about the long term. But when she sits up there and thinks about the long term, that social media is not a thing no more, the show ain't a thing no more, she's going to think about the choice that she made. It's going to hit her. Because right now she's very prideful, very boastful. It seems like the situation has not humbled her, even though this is a situation that could should humble her. You know what I mean? You had to be with a married man. Like, that's not cool publicly. You know what I mean? But it's going to get to her sooner or later. It always do. But other than that, let me know what y'all think. Yeah, like, I don't even see how Sheree, again, was able to pick him to go along with her for a storyline. Even if it is a fake relationship, she could have picked anybody else. Well, why Martell? terrible <laughs> let me know what y'all think and i'll talk to you guys again soon bye